Hello fellow guardians of high places. Welcome to another one of our weekly episodes. This episode I have my haul bag here. I've had this haul bag forever. I take it on every single trip of wherever I go. I put all my climbing gear there. And on the side here, on all these haul bags, there's a nice useful pouch. And inside this pouch, I carry very useful items. In today's episode, I'm gonna show you what they are and uh, why you should bring them on your next climbing trip. Let's roll the intro. Okay, how exciting. It's like a one-sided show and tell. What's in the blue bag? Let's get started. What do we start off with? Right, toothbrush. It's very important for a climber to have great oral hygiene, but toothbrushes serve another purpose. You've probably seen this if you go to climbing gyms. There'll be these little side pieces to chalk bags, and that's to hold your toothbrush. Why the toothbrush? Do climbers brush their teeth while they climb? No, because chalk builds up and it gets kind of nasty after a while with all that chalk buildup. So you want to get a toothbrush in there, scrub off that old chalk, slap some new chalk on and everything's right as rain. Also, a little story time, I was climbing for days in El Cap one time and the chalk started to build up under my fingernail. I started to get this pain after a few days. I was wondering what the heck it was. The chalk was pushing back my uh, cuticles or whatever the heck this is. This, I don't know what the technical term is for that, but yeah, fun story. Don't, you want every want to wash your hands after every climb. I actually have a video of me somewhere saying that. I think I'll find it and I'll put it in here. What? Any words of advice? No. Yeah, wash your hands after every climb. Anyway, toothbrushes, very important, comes with you on every trip. Uh, let's see what else. Well, we're on the top of a hygiene, clipping your nails. Very important to clip your nails. You don't want long nails while you're climbing because then you'll end up cracking your nail weird, wrong, and or the whole nail might lift up or something and that'll, be, that'll just ruin your whole day. Actually, I should probably clip my nails right now. Kind of nasty. <laughs> okay, what else we got in here? Toothpicks. Well, that's because if I get something stuck in my teeth, it really sucks. Okay, uh, what else you got in here? Always bring a snack. Always bring a nice snack after a climb. And of course, every climber has to have Cliff Bar. I mean, come on. What's your favorite flavor? Mine is white chocolate macadamia nut. It's probably my favorite. I also like chocolate brownie. What's your favorite? Leave it in the comments down below. I'd like to know. Not a sponsor. What else? Uh, tape. Last episode. Last week's episode is about tape. Check it out. Put it up here. Tape is very important to bring with you all the time. It's got way too many uses. And uh, actually, I've seen somebody one time use tape as like a fake locking beaner. I don't know. I don't know what people would think about that. But you can take tape and wrap it around here as a fake uh, pseudo walkie beaner. What do you think about that, guys? <laughs> anyway, yeah, tape, very important. Bring with you on every climb. Uh, what else? Oh, a knife. We all know what a knife is for, right? And he's gonna die if you don't do this stuff. Cut the rope! No, I won't do it! Just cut the rope! I can't! Stop cut the rope! Any second out, a camera's gonna come out of the wall, and Annie, and you are gonna die! Stop is that what you want? It. You're gonna kill your Stop sister! It. Stop it! No. I cut the damn rope! Cut Don't it! Do it! Doesn't Don't matter do about it. me, just cut it! No. We're running out of time here! Don't do it, Peter. Just cut it! Nobody's Don't gonna blame you for it! Just cut it, Peter! No. We're gonna die! No. Annie and you are gonna die! Just no. cut it, Peter! No. Please! Actually, you might never know when you need to cut some webbing or something. So, yeah, always bring a knife with you. It has many uses, but. Knives also need a friend, and that friend is a lighter. And why? Because this is a synthetic rope. You can see that nasty fraying rope right there is no good for nothing. So if you bring your friend the lighter, 
if you can do this only with synthetic ropes, you can't do it with cotton or hemp or any of those kind of ropes because they'll just burn. But synthetic ropes, they tend to melt and leave a nice finish when you're done. Just like that. They melt together. Ouch. And then leave a nice little finish, just like that. So yeah, knife and a lighter. And uh, let's say, oh yeah, of course. A battery for your headlamp. Headlamps are really important. You don't want to get done with the, the climb at the end of the day and it's dark, pitch black, can't see the hand in front of your face. You'll be really happy. Well, actually now you can probably just put your phone on flashlight mode. But anyway, you should always have a headlamp. Headlamps are really useful. Another thing I always bring. So that's what I bring with me. Let me know what you bring with you on your climbing trip so you can't live without. And uh, I think that about wraps it up. Josh Perry climbing out of here. Have a good week, guys. See you next week. Oh, rope. Hey, oh, I dropped it. Drop string is a wasted thing.